Luca, 3-0 win here at Morecambe. The run goes on. What was your assessment of it? Uh, it was a good game. I feel like we uh, started really well. Obviously, we got two early goals and then, yeah, obviously it was a, a tough day with the condition. It was really hot and windy, and, uh, but I feel like we dealt with that a lot better than they did. Talk to us about the goals and the first one in particular, the counter-attack. Lototala catches it within two passes, it's at your feet. Yeah, I feel like that's what we've been doing a lot. Uh, recently, we've been a lot better on the counter-attack and uh, see Hux has got the ball down the wing and uh, put a great ball in and then luckily I just was able to finish it. And then obviously the free kick on the second one, which we've we've worked on a bit on the training ground. We've, uh, we wanted to make it look like Hux was going to take it and then me come over last minute and then just put it down the side of the wall and it worked. It's one thing working on it, but actually actually executing it's a, a different thing. Did you know as soon as it had left your left boot? I actually didn't see it go in. I couldn't see it because the wall, but I just had to listen to the cheers, really. But, uh, yeah, I knew I could have got it round, but it was just whether it would have went in or not. Just how much of an understanding is there now between you and Haki? Because you've not been teammates for too long, but it seems like you're both on each other's wavelength. Yeah, I feel like it quick, quite, quite quick. And, uh, obviously, we've played a lot of games recently together. Uh, the front three has been quite similar for most of the most of the games and we've got a good connection together and I know what he likes to do when he comes inside and he's probably the same with me and I feel like uh, we're contributing really well for the team at the moment. There's quite a lot of switching going on as well, isn't there? So even if it, maybe if it doesn't work for five minutes on one side, you'll, you'll quite often go to the other and, and come back again. Yeah, it's just mixing up a bit and just uh, to keep the defenders on the toes. Obviously, they'll probably be thinking they're going to just be up against Hacks the full game and same on my side, but obviously it's good to probably switch and just mix it up. Eight goals for the season now. Have you got your eyes on double-figure mark? Yeah, I feel like that's definitely the, the goal at the moment. Um, you see five games left, I think it's more than doable. Approaching 100 Rovers appearances as well. I think if you were to play every game between now and the end of the season, you'd, you'd reach that figure. Hoping that coming off today, was that just fatigue? So you'd be all right for Tuesday? Yeah, yeah. I was just a bit tired, to be honest. I've been a bit, had a bad stomach this morning and uh, was just trying to get through the game. But yeah, I, I wasn't feeling too well. But yeah, it was just fatigue more than anything. I feel fine, legs are fine, um, no injuries. So yeah, go again on Tuesday. Six wins on the bounce, four clean sheets on the bounce to go with it as well. What just sum up what the dressing room's like to be a part of right now? Because you've been a you know a part of this team for two years. Last season didn't go the way anybody wanted it to. How different is it now compared to say twelve months ago? Yeah, it's been brilliant, especially the last few months. It's obviously it's always been a good change room every time the whole time I've been here, but recently it's just been top draw. Like the lads are all really close as a group, like there's no groups. Yeah. Yeah, like everyone's so tight knit, and it's obviously shown on the pitch. And I feel like we've got that connection on the pitch, and everyone's everyone's just clicking at the moment, and it's uh, it's good to see. How well's the manager done to work on those combinations on the pitch? Because you don't you only have to look so sort of behind you for the connection with Jamie Sterry. You know, you've got Owen Bailey on the inside, who's from the northeast as well, and and that can help, can't it? When you've got players on the pitch who you're close to and you know off it, you're always going to perform well on it. Yeah, definitely, obviously. Like you said, me and Stez have played with each other for years now, so we both know what each other like and don't like, and you just feel comfortable with someone like that behind you. And then obviously with Bills as well, obviously I've known him for a while, but this is the first time I've actually been able to play with him, and he's been brilliant this season. He's been obviously he's all he's all over the place on the pitch, and he's been a top draw, and uh, it's just good to see. And it's obviously like you said, with all the stuff that goes on the pitch and what we work on the training pitch, and it's just like it's so good when you see it come off. Owen stole the limelight with a winner on, on Tuesday. Only right that you were to go and get a double today to take it back Yeah, up. my turn today, my turn. <laughs> well done today. Cheers, thank you.